Today I'm going to talk today. Why does it always sound so weird when I say that? Today. Today. To enunciate. Enunciate. Today we're going to use two packs of 24 inch gear ties. Each pack has two of them in it and we're going to use two of those packages for a total of four. Let's go ahead and take the GoPro off of here. What we have is this little bendy pod. And we don't have to make it with this head on it, but that seems to be the, the best way to do it. You could thread this directly on there. Uh, I think it's just a little easier to like fine tune it when when you have that ball head on there, especially when this is all twisted around stuff. So let's take a look at how we build this. It's really easy. I'm gonna take it apart. And I have a quarter 20 carriage bolt. This is what threads into the tripod or into the GoPro. I'm using a cage on the GoPro, that's why I have a normal thread for a camera. And that's quarter inch by 20 threads per inch, quarter 20. And it's three inches long. We take three of the gear ties and put them together like this. So there's our little bundle of gear ties. Just try to straighten them out a little bit. Stick the carriage bolt down in there so this is all flush. And then we take this extra one and we wrap it up. And you may have to unwind this and tighten it back up depending on how much of the thread is sticking out. See how there's not enough thread right there sticking out? All right, so I need to like get farther out here. So I'm gonna put my finger in there and I need about that much space. So I'm gonna unwind this again. And push it all the way over tight. And we're gonna try to wind this really close. Right there, that looks better. Now when we pull this down, we have the right amount of threads in there. And if you twist these up, you're going to have a little bit more rigidity. And this mini ball head works pretty well. I actually, there's another brand I like a little bit better. This one was inexpensive. I prefer the ones that have a 3 8 hole in the bottom, 3 8 16. This one is only a quarter 20. Usually the 3 8 16 hole in the bottom uh, will allow you to put an adapter on there and you can do 3 8 or quarter inch. That works well. Then we can just put our little camera on there. You can always bend these up. That would be little sturdier way of doing it. The real use for this is gonna be hooking it on branches, fence posts, um, light stands, wherever you can take a Gorilla Pod and wrap it around things, this'll work. It is gonna be a little less stable than a Gorilla Pod, but considering the fact that these are just handy things to keep in your bag, all you have to have extra is a three inch quarter 20 carriage bolt and you can make yourself a little tripod. So the whole idea with these gear ties, having them in your, in your bag is versatility. You can do a lot with them uh, with something that you could just put together really quickly. Something like that. And it doesn't, it's hardly any weight, doesn't take up much room in your bag. If you need the gear ties to like tie up your cords, if you need uh, to hold up, like for instance right now, I have gear ties holding the power strip onto my C-stand for my overhead rig. 
I have uh, gear ties holding my microphone. It's just, they're really handy. And this is just another use for this very versatile, lightweight, inexpensive tool to keep in your bag.